All right, guys. Now with this trick, people are gonna stop you in the street and they're gonna ask you if your lower lashes are fake because this is crazy. All right. So I heard about Billy B through the YouTube user Scandalous Beauty. She has a lot of videos up and she always talks about him. And you know, I decided to um, check him out and look at his work, which is really impressive and it's really inspirational for like new looks and all of the artists that he's done and everything. It was pretty cool. And he also has a line of brushes. So I took a look at them to see if there was anything that he had that was different from what I already had. And I got two brushes. And you guys have already seen me use his brow brush, which is the number 11 brush because it's really stiff and short and everything. I don't know. It's just the brush that I was looking for. So I'm happy with that one. And then I got another brush. And let me show you the packaging. It comes like this in a little tube. And this is the number nine brush. And it's for applying mascara on lower lashes. I mean, it's just insane. You probably don't need this, but I thought it was cool. <laughs> so here's what it looks like. And it looks just like this brush. It has a little bit of lipstick on it because I used the 231 for lipstick too. 231, there we go, and the Billy B brush. Now, this brush is stiffer compared to this brush, and it's shorter, and it's a little bit more tapered. Okay, so let's get to it. Now, I'm going to use my makeshift palette. This is a mirror, since I don't have a palette yet. And it has some mascara on it, but I went over the whole thing with some brush cleanser to disinfect it. And now I'm just going to take some of my mascara and just put it on my palette like that. I wish I had some cake mascara because that would really work and I wouldn't have to make such a mess. All right, and I used um, a sponge and I place it under my lower lashes. So my lower lashes are on top of the sponge. And okay, I'm just going to load my brush with mascara. Okay, put the lower lashes on the sponge. And this is very tricky, but this would be a lot easier to do on somebody else. So I just paint it on and slide it out. Move in. I try to get as close to the waterline as I can, but not on the waterline. Trying to paint all the little well, lashes. Now I'm just separating them a little bit because it's time to replace that mascara. There we go, separating. I need a little bit more on this inner corner. Bam, crazy. And some of my lower lashes are in, insanely long, but we'll fix that. All right, and I still managed to get some of it <clears throat> on my skin, but we'll wait for it to dry to take it off. A little bit more here. 
just laying it on top of the lash. And then I'm just using the same brush to separate it. All right, let's get the comb. So I have one pesky one. And you can see the difference between this eye with the mascara and this eye. And any place that it's too long, I just use my finger and just press your lashes like this in between your fingers on the, you know, the tip of your lashes with your fingers and the mascara will come on, on come off on your finger that way. Doesn't look too insane. All right, now I'm going to do the other the other eye and I'll be right back. All right guys, so I already did the other side and I'm sure you can tell from the shadows of my lower lashes that they're crazy. All right, and I'm going to take some pictures because this lighting isn't helping at all. Just clean up a little bit. All right, and again, this is the brush. I really like it. It's crazy. I mean, imagine with a smoky eye and then doing your lower lashes with this. People are gonna stop, stop you in the street and ask you how you did that, because that's crazy. All right, so um, now let's move on to uh, cheeks and lips.